Can you bypass a starter solenoid? Simply put, to overcome and bypass a faulty starter relay or ignition switch, you can touch both the positive starter terminal and the solenoid terminal on the starter using a big screwdriver. Because the starter terminal is always connected directly to the battery positive terminal, this will bypass the starter relay. What happens when a solenoid fails? Number 1. The starter solenoid failing to reset, even upon releasing the starter button, or turn the car switch in the off position, the starter continues to operate. The starter solenoid failing to work up the starter to cause rotation. It only makes a series of sounds without starting the engine. How do you test a starter solenoid? Have a friend turn the key in the ignition to attempt to start the vehicle. Listen carefully, as you should hear a click when the starter solenoid engages. If you do not hear a click, the starter solenoid is likely not functioning properly. If you do hear clicking, the solenoid may be engaging, but not sufficiently. Can you bypass solenoid on golf cart? The simplest way to bypass solenoid on a golf cart just attempt connecting two large wires of terminals of the solenoid. Then attempt to operate the cart. If it doesn't work, the solenoid is not your problem. What does a bad solenoid sound like? You hear a whirring, grinding, or squealing sound from the engine. If you hear either a gentle whirring or an irritating screeching sound coming from under the hood when you turn the key, it's likely that a bad solenoid is causing freewheeling. Don't forget to subscribe for more of these videos.